It looks easy, but the service toss can be one of the game's most difficult motions to master. Here's a tip for mastering it. Bring your tossing arm straight up or close to it while tilting your shoulders backwards. I'm David Popeil, and this is Cross Court Rabbit Complete Tennis. You will notice that when serving, the pros bring their tossing arm all the way up or close to all the way up. That is to say that though the ball leaves their tossing hand at around face height, the tossing arm keeps rising until it points straight up or at least nearly straight up to the sky, as Serena does in this clip. And for some of the pros, the tossing arm continues moving until it actually points to the rear, as Carlos Alcaraz does here. In contrast, the vast majority of recreational players end the upward motion of their tossing arm well before it points to the sky at something like a 45 degree angle to the court. But you may ask, is this important? Good question, and here's the answer. Service toss is an unfortunate, an unfortunate term. There's a hint of carelessness in the term toss. What you're really trying to do is gently lift the ball to a very precise point in the path of your swinging racket. If you stop your arm's upward motion as soon as you release the ball, the motion will be a herky-jerky one, and consequently, you will lose a lot of control over the ball's upward path. When you keep your arm moving towards straight up well after releasing the ball, you eliminate the abruptness of the release and thus increase your control of the ball's flight. However, to comfortably bring your arm straight up, you have to get your head out of the way. To do that, you have to tilt your shoulders backwards, as you can see. If I keep my shoulders level, raising my arms straight up even looks uncomfortable, and I have to strain to get the arms skyward. My head is in the way. To comfortably lift your tossing arm to the sky, you must tilt your shoulders backwards. This gets your head out of the way of your rising arm, and then, when you go into the forward part of your service motion, you will re-tilt your shoulders, meaning that you will lower your front shoulder and bring your rear shoulder upwards until you are actually tilting forward, as you've just seen. And that quick upward motion of the rear shoulder adds energy to your swing. The backward lift stores upward motion. And what do you do once you have your tossing arm straight up? Keep it there for as long as possible. Now, that won't be long, but the point is to not drop the tossing arm prematurely. Because if you do, as your shoulders tilt forward, so will your head, and with it, your eyes. The premature forward shoulder tilt will render you more likely to hit downward, resulting in a ball that lands short in the service box or goes into the net. And of course, if that early forward tilt takes your eyes off the ball, as it may, you're even more likely to serve a fault. And here's a tip on how to get that tossing arm up high. 
The truth is that simply lifting the tossing arm skyward will tilt your shoulders backward at least to a certain extent. However, I suggest that you not rely on the toss to tilt your shoulders. I suggest you lead with the shoulder tilt just a bit. Let your shoulder tilt proceed slightly ahead of your upward arm motion. This assures that your head will be out of the way of your tossing arm and you will find that this early tilt makes it easier to bring your arm toward the straight up position. And one last word. Tilting backwards will also tend to bend your knees, especially your rear knee. When you swing upward, your knees will, of course, straighten, and that will contribute to the pace of your upward swing. Yet another advantage of raising your tossing arm high and tossing with a tilt. That's it for the toss and tilt. Work on it. If you liked this video, please click the thumbs up button below. And if you're not already subscribing to Cross Court Rabbit Complete Tennis, please consider doing so. Above all, keep playing the greatest of all games, and I'll see you again soon.